Well, in your, your question, according to my, my feeling is, has three elements. Uh, one of them, the main one is uh, energy transition. Um, surely it's a trending topic now. Uh, everybody is talking about energy transition all over the world because uh, climate action has forced us to take a definite uh, uh, control of the solutions and the energy and energy efficiency uh, has become has become uh, very very uh, uh, relevant to tackle this matter. So I prefer calling it an energy evolution. So we must go from fossil fuels to cleaner sources. But uh, what is included, embedded in this in this matter, is emissions. So uh, LNG surely has uh, placed a, a, a good initial. Uh, solution for those uh, highly intensive uses of fossil fuels and um, coal or diesel. And uh, but, however, uh, its GHG reduction potential is still depending on capturing uh, that carbon contained in the process and using it and or storing it. But something must be done with that with that carbon. And uh, so uh, that's in our case uh, in Chile, we did it uh, longly and we still are doing it. However, we have placed our main bets in renewable energy and renewable energy, uh, of course, this emission uh, is uh, very low carbon. You cannot say zero because you never know how the machines or the equipments were done, but, but it's a highly low emission. Uh, processes, all of them. And if you add the green hydrogen production, hydrolysis, uh, electrolysis through, uh, to, 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 through, through a defined and well-known technology, uh, this, this is, turns to a, a real solution in many areas. And that's what we are committed to. We want to become and we are working to do it as a real accelerator of this uh, of these processes because we have the gift of having highly uh, high capacity for renewables uh, in, in 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 solar and wind energy so i think that lng is part of the solution uh, surely green hydrogen is uh, is a deeper uh, solution especially for the for the the long term uh, matters in terms of decarbonization goals and uh, and all the, the the commitments that that climate change has forced us to take and finally have uh, taken. Thank you.